how to highlight screenshot on mac if you are using macbook air macbook pro imac or mac mini the steps are going to be same for all these mac machines now for example purpose i have already uh, taken a screenshot over here as you can see i have named it screenshot one so this is how uh, the screenshot is i have taken the screenshot of the settings page right now what if uh, i want to highlight some parts in this particular screenshot for that all you need to do is just select uh, the screenshot by single tapping uh, on your mouse or on your uh, trackpad right click and then select open with option and then open it with preview now once you open preview this is how the uh, preview application looks like you can just uh, you know uh, make it full screen now uh, let's say for example if i want to highlight this particular part over here which says show scroll bars and click in the scroll bar too so i want to highlight this option for that all you need to do just go and select the markup toolbar over here the one with the circular icon and the marker icon just select this option and you will get multiple options over here at the bottom right now first of all you need to select any particular shape for that for selecting any particular shape you can just go over here you can select this drop down now you have multiple options you have square you have circle option you have message like icon over here and there are much more options over here so let's say if i want to select the square option it will appear over here if you want to adjust it you can just simply go and adjust it now currently it is showing uh, the opacity is somewhere around uh, you know it's less than 50 percent i'll come to that later first when you add any particular shape you just need to select the or adjust the size as per your requirement so this is how i want to highlight my screenshot i want to highlight this particular area after adjusting each and everything if you want to change the color of the border now currently the border color is pink so if you want to change it to black or some other color you can always go and select this border option over here select this drop down and you get multiple uh, multiple colors to choose from so let's say if uh, you want to highlight the border color to red you can go and select red option and now you can see the border color has been changed now if you want to change the main color which is over here in this area for that you can select this option you can select this drop down and you can change the color from here so let's say if you uh, if you want yellow color so this is how the color looks like now you can see uh, as soon as i change the color i am unable to see what's in the background so if you want to uh, just highlight that uh, once again you can select this drop down select show colors option over here and then you need to adjust the opacity so select this toggle you can you know just increase or decrease the opacity level over here so let's say if you want somewhere around here 55 percent we are good to go so now you can see we have adjusted the opacity now we have highlighted uh, this particular part and also we are able to see what's in the background again if you want to change the border color go on this border option change the color if you uh, if you want black select black over here first of all you need to select this particular uh, shape which you have add it over there then select the background and then select black color now you can see the border color has been changed similarly if you want to add some another shape or something go uh, in shape option if you want to add ellipse or circle just go and add it you can again do the changes by adjusting the size if you want to increase or decrease the size you can do that over here as well now once you adjust the shape again if you want to change the color make sure you select that particular shape go over here change the color now we have selected red again it is not visible select that select show colors adjust the opacity level and if you want to change the border color for that go in border option over here and change the border color so let's say if i select green or some other color let's say if i want to select orange i've done that so this is how simple it is to highlight your screenshot now if you want to save it you can just go in file option over here in the menu bar and then select save right so once you select save the same screenshot will be saved with this highlighted part so again if i go in the main screenshot you can see the highlighted or the edited screenshot has been saved but what if you want uh, the main screenshot to be different and the edited or the highlighted screenshot to be different for that all you need to do is again open preview option and then go in file and select duplicate option over here so as soon as you uh, select duplicate you can see a duplicate file has been created so this was the original and this is the duplicate so it is named as screenshot one copy so now over here you can just select the screenshot and you can delete whichever things you have added just select it and press delete option on your keyboard and then 
you will be able to save it. So for saving this one, again, go in file and select save option. So now you can see, now it is showing us the highlight because we are creating another copy. So this one you can create as screenshot too. You can select the format over here, right? I'm going to select JPEG. You, if you want to increase or decrease the quality, you can do that as well. You can select the destination where you want to save it and then select save option. So now if I close this one, now you can see, this is the screenshot which we have saved now and this is the screenshot which we have highlighted so yeah uh, that's how simple it is to highlight uh, your screenshot in your mac so if you find this video informative don't forget to subscribe i'll see you all in the next one thank you